QFO is a meeting that started right on the heels of the sequencing of the human genome. It stands for the Human Proteome Organization. And the goal for this group is to get a clear understanding of all the proteins in the human organism and obviously other organisms as well, what they do, and especially what role they play in human disease. AB SciX has a long history and relationship with the HUPO organization and all the members that attend these kind of conferences. We were here at the beginning, at the first meeting. We've been a major player at each one of the sessions. Many of our scientists present here. Well, one of the key events that we're doing at, at HUPO this year in Sydney is introducing the 5600 Triple Toff. Obviously, they'd heard a little bit about it since ASMS when we introduced it publicly, but this is the first chance we've had to, to have them see the instrumentation, to look at some of the data that we've been generating with it, and to talk about its applicability and the workflows they're at. The 5600 is the fastest, most sensitive, accurate mass mass spectrometer in the market today. Along with the 5600, though, a lot of the discussions we're having with customers here at this meeting is not just instrumentation, but what we're doing in the software area and some of the innovations that we're bringing in the chemistry. A key part of the discussion that's going on here this week, both amongst the scientific community in general, but specifically ourselves with a number of customers, is this area of peptide quant or protein quant and the new workflows that are enabled by the QTRAP 5500 and applying it to developing assays for all the proteins in the human organism. The first 100,000 assays were announced this week. A fair portion of it was done on 5500 QTRAP technology. We didn't get to where we're at here without working very closely, obviously, with our customers. Customers talk, we listen. And to see it come alive at a meeting like this, where we've had workshops, luncheons, one-on-one -on -one discussions. What's exciting is to have this meeting, which happens all over the world in the last nine years. It's, it's moved to every continent and every major city in the, in the world, to have it now finally down here in Australia. The relationship with these customers that we've seen at different meetings globally, to be on their home turf, have some of our scientists down here, has been fantastic.